Hey, what is going on guys? This is iReviews. In this video, I will show you the top 80 city tweaks compatible with iOS 9. Stealth Cam. This tweak allows you to take pictures even when your device is locked. All you have to do is just open the camera app. Now you can lock your device and as you can see, I can still take pictures even with the screen off. Folder Enhancer. This tweak allows you to customize your folders and also will add some new features to the folders on iOS 9. You can see right here if I open a folder I have a 4x4 layout and the transparency on the background is different. You can also create nested folders on iOS 9 using this tweak. To do all these customizations you need to go to settings, go to folder enhancer and here you have folders. Here you can customize the appearance of your folders, here you can set the numbers of columns and rows to any number you want, 3, 4 or 5. Apex 2. This tweak allows you to group apps on a very cool way. You can see right here if I swipe on the icon of the calculator, I have another app here, the Twitter app. And if I want to add more apps to this group, all I have to do is just tap and hold this icon. Here you see this plus signs, just tap on it and choose any app you like. Color badges. This tweak will colorize the badges based on the color of the icon. As you can see here, blue icon, blue badge. Now if you go to the settings of this tweak, you have an enable button. You can enable here support for Apex. You can also enable borders right here. And you can also enable always white text and borders. Custom notification sounds. This tweak allows you to set custom sounds for the notifications of third-party apps. If you go here to an app on the notification sections on the settings app, here you have custom sound. If you go here, you can enable sound and also here you can choose a custom sound for the notifications of this app. Flip Control Center. This tweak allows you to add more toggles and quick launches to the control center of your iOS 9 device. You can see here I have a lot of more toggles here and quick launches and you can add them or remove them by going to settings go to flip control center and here you have active switches if you go here you have all the enabled and down here you have the disabled ones you can also rearrange them or enable and disable any one you want last app this tweak allows you to easily move between your two last apps you can see right here if i open calculator and then i go ahead and open safari I can double tap here on the status bar and it will take me to, to the calculator, double tap again, it will take me to Safari, double tap again, you can see how it will, it will switch between two last apps. Now after you install this tweak you need to go to settings, go to activator and here you will set a gesture which you will use to switch between your two last apps. Alarm volume. This tweak allows you to set a custom volume for your alarms. To do that you need to go to the settings of this tweak, enable these two switches right here and then here you have the volume. You can also set a fade in, you can also enable this tweak for the timer and you can enable here vibrations for the alarms and for the timer. Stop CC in app. This tweak allows you to stop the control sender from appearing on a certain app. You can see right here if I open the calculator app the control center won't appear at all and this is very useful for example for games or an app in which you will launch the control center accidentally you can use this tweak to disable control center in that app now if you go to the settings of this tweak you have an enable button then here you can choose in which of your apps you want to stop the control center from appearing swipe for more this tweak allows you to easily install and uninstall tweaks from Cydia. All you have to do is just swipe here on a tweak and you can install it or if you already have it installed, you can uninstall it just like that. Switcher Flipper. This is a simple tweak. All it does is that it will flip this side of the scroll on the card view on your app switcher. Unlock Sound. This tweak will bring back the unlock sound to your iOS 9 device. As you can hear right here, the unlock sound will be back on your iOS 9 device 
and if you go to the settings of this tweak you can enable it right here then you can set a custom sound right here you have all different sounds that you can choose from hide settings search this is a simple tweak all it does is that it will hide the search bar from the settings app if you don't need it or you don't use it you can hide it using this tweak universal mute this tweak will mute both the ringer and the media volume when you turn on the mute switch on your device as you can see right here it will mute both the ringer and the media volume insta tools this tweak will add some very useful features to the instagram app on your ios 9 device as you can see right here two more buttons one is to save pictures to the camera roll and one to share them you can also tap and hold a picture and you can zoom in and out on that picture faces this tweak allows you to customize the lock screen of your device by adding different images as the background of the passcode buttons you can see here you can add a different image for each of the passcode buttons on your lock screen now to do that you need to go to your settings go to faces enable it then here you have choose images if you go here you will have all the buttons just click one of them and you can choose the background for that button icon renamer this tweak allows you to rename any of the icons on your device all you have to do is just tap and hold one of the icons and now just tap one of them and as you can see you can rename it right here sleek code this tweak allows you to customize the passcode screen of your iOS 9 device. You can see here how cool it looks. You have no circles here around the buttons. It looks very nice. And if you go to the settings of this tweak, here you have passcode settings. If you go here, you can enable blur. You can also disable the button rings, button animations. You can also hide the emergency button. And if you go back here, you have a respring button for all the changes to take effect. Aurea LS. This tweak allows you to replace the clock on the lock screen with this cool looking clock. As you can see it right here. Very nice and clean look. Now you can customize it by going to the settings. Then here you have Aurea LS. You go to clock face settings and then you go here. You can choose between three different clocks and you can also customize here the fonts. You can also enable 24 hour and also show AM and PM. Enable live photos. This tweak will bring the live photos feature from the iPhone 6S and the 6S Plus to older devices. You can see this button right here. All you have to do is just tap it. And now when you take a picture, it will take a live picture. You can see here. Now when I go to take a look at this picture, all I have to do is just tap it. And as you can see, we have a live photo right there. This tweak doesn't have any options to configure, all you have to do is install it. Berry C8. This tweak allows you to open apps directly from your lock screen. All you have to do is just tap on an icon, drag it down here, and it will open that app. Now if you go to the settings of this tweak, you have an enable button, then here you have the shortcuts. You can add up to 12 apps on your lock screen, just go here and pick any app you want. Now if you go back, then here you have the icon size, apps per page, and also you can enable or disable badges on your lock screen. 4C. This tweak will bring the 3D touch feature to older iOS devices. You can see right here, if I swipe up on the icon of the camera, here it will show me the same options as it shows on 3D touch devices. You can see if I tap here, I can go ahead and quickly record a video directly from here better shut down this tweak will give you some more options when you go to the power down menu of your device you can see here you will have power off reboot or respring you can choose either one of these options from the shutdown menu now if you go to the settings of this tweak here you can disable it on the lock screen you can choose between two different themes and you can enable or disable safe mode battery life this tweak will give you detailed information about the battery life of your device when you install it you will get this icon on your home screen you tap it and here will have all the detailed informations about the life of your battery album shot this tweak will create a separate folder 
for each of the apps where you take a screenshot. You can see right here I have calculator, I did take a screenshot on the calculator app and now it will place it on the calculator album on the photo library. Double cut. This tweak allows you to enter your email anywhere you want simply by double tapping a key on your keyboard. Now you can see right here I'm using the add key, double tap on that and as you can see it will enter my email. Now if you go to the settings of this tweak here you can set which key you want to use. You just go here, enter the key and then enter your email right here and click save. CC settings. This tweak allows you to make more use of the control center of your device. It allows you to add or remove any toggles you want. You can see right here I have a bunch of toggles and you can add them or remove them simply by going to the settings of this tweak. Here you have include and then down here you have do not include. If you want to remove one you just drag them down here. You can also go ahead and rearrange them any way you like. Cask. This tweak will add these nice animations when you scroll through lists as you can see them right here and if you go to the settings of this tweak here you can choose between different styles if you go here you have five different styles you can also change the duration right here. Barrel this is one of the most known city tweaks which will add these cool animations when you swipe through your pages on your home screen. If you go to settings and go to barrel here you will have mode and you can choose between different animations and apply them to your springboard. Alkaline. This tweak allows you to customize the battery icon on the status bar of your device. If you go to the settings of this tweak here you will have an enable button to enable or disable this tweak. Then here you have theme. If you go here you will have three different themes that you can choose from. Shift cycle. This is a very useful tweak which allows you to select the text and then you can just press the shift key and as you can see you can change all the text. You can set all the text on uppercase or tap once again and you can change the complete text in lowercase. Elm Poem. This tweak will add more options to your device when you take a screenshot. You can see right here if I take a screenshot on my device it will ask me if I want to save it to photo library, copy it, upload it or I can go ahead and share this screenshot directly from here. CC Matters. This tweak will add some very useful information to the control center of your device. Here you will have the percentage of usage of your CPU, here you have your free RAM memory, here you have your free space on your device and then here you have the data, the upload and the download. CC Loader. This tweak allows you to customize the control center of your device by enabling or disabling any of these sections of the control center. Now if you go to the settings of this tweak here you can enable or disable any of these sections. You can also rearrange them any way you like. Swipe selection. This tweak allows you to easily move the cursor anywhere on the text simply by swiping your finger through the keyboard. You can also select text by swiping your finger from the shift key or from the delete key. You can see right here just slide like this and it will easily select any text you want. Folder 6 Plus. This tweak will add some very cool features to the folders on your iOS 9 device. As you can see right here it will add a 4x4 layout to your folders and also it will allow you to create nested folders which means that you can create a new folder inside of a folder. Delete forever. This tweak allows you to easily delete pictures permanently from your device so that you don't have to go to the recently deleted folder and delete them once again. All you have to do is just tap here and this picture will be deleted from the device and you won't see it on the recently deleted album. Blurry badges. This tweak will add this nice blur to the badges of your icons and as you can see right here the color of the badge will match the color of the icon. And if you go to the settings of this tweak here you can set the border size, the border color and you can also set here the badge tint. Spotlight be gone. This tweak allows you to disable the spotlight from your home screen. You can also disable the search page that you have on the left side 
of your home screen. Now to do that you need to go to your settings, go to spotlight be gone and here you have two toggles where you can enable or disable the spotlight on your device. CC background. This tweak allows you to customize the background of your control center by adding any of your images as the background of your control center. To do that you need to go to your settings, go to CC background, enable it, then go here, select image and you can pick any of your images and set it as the background of your control center. Minimal hood. This tweak will replace your stock volume hood with this very cool volume hood as you can see it right here on the side of the device. It looks very cool and it won't interrupt you anything on your screen. Now if you go to the settings of this tweak you have an enable button then here you can choose between four different themes and also you can change its position right here. Same status. Have you ever noticed the status bar on the lock screen It's bigger than it is on the home screen? Now this is what this tweak does, it will keep the status bar on the lock screen and on the home screen at the same size. Custom LS This tweak allows you to customize the lock screen of your device. As you can see right here instead of slide to unlock, I have written eye reviews, you can also hide the grabbers and the clock on your lock screen. Now if you go to the settings of this tweak, here you can change all the different settings for this tweak and here you can set a custom slide to unlock text. Better 4x4 folders. This tweak allows you to have a 4x4 layout on the folders of your iOS 9 device. As you can see right here we have a 4x4 layout so you can have more apps on a page on your folders. Portrait lock. This tweak allows you to enable portrait lock when you open certain apps. If you go to the settings of this tweak you can enable it right here. Then if you go to portrait you can choose in which apps you want to enable portrait lock when you open that app. Here I have the calculator and as you can see when I open the calculator it will enable the portrait lock. Color reachability. This tweak allows you to change the color on the reachability view. As you can see here we have a blue color and you can change it to any color you like. To do that you need to go to the settings of this tweak, enable it, then go to tint color and here you can pick any color you like. You can also set the blur amount right here, you can randomize or you can reset the color right here. Status bar timer. Whenever you start the stopwatch or the timer on your clock app you will see the timer right here on the status bar right next to the clock. Very useful tweak, it doesn't have any options to configure, all you have to do is install it. Multi Icon Mover Plus. This tweak allows you to move a lot of icons at the same time. You can see right here all you have to do is just tap and hold one of the icons, then just tap on every icon that you want to move you can see this check mark right here. Now go to the page that you want to move them to. Just click like this and you can see it will move all the icons at the same time. Dock Shift. This tweak allows you to customize the background of the dock of your iOS 9 device. As you can see right here the dock of my device has a white background and you can change between different backgrounds by going to the settings of this tweak. You can enable it right here, then here you have style. If you go here you can choose between different styles and apply them to the dock of your device. Share Pro. This tweak will add this floating button on your home screen which you can move anywhere you like and it allows you to quickly share from anywhere on your home screen. You just tap this button and here it will give you options to share to your social media. And if you tap and hold this button then it will give you some other options here. You can shut down, restart, respring or send to safe mode your device. Advanced settings 8. This tweak allows you to have access to hidden settings of your device. Now to do that all you have to do is just tap and hold the settings icon as you can see right here. This page will pop up and here you have all the hidden settings of your device. Now if you change any of these settings and you want to return them to their default you will have this button right here. Just tap here and it will restore all the default settings. Reveal NC9. This is a simple tweak all it does is that it will add this nice android animation to the notification center when you slide it down or up. As you can see this cool animation, it doesn't have any options to configure. 
Reveal menu. This tweak will add the 3D touch feature to older iOS 9 devices. You can see right here, all I have to do is just tap and hold one of the icons and now it will give me options here just like it does on 3D touch devices. You can see here, I don't have to lift my finger, just tap and then I, I can slide my finger like this, just release it and I can take a quick action directly from that menu. C Clean allows you to customize the control center of your iOS 9 device. As you can see right here, you can hide the backgrounds for the sliders, also you can hide the backgrounds from the toggles and the quick launches. As you can see, it looks pretty cool and you can do all this by going to the settings of this tweak. Here you have all the switches to do these customizations and then here a respring button for all the changes to take effect. Better 5 Icon Dock this tweak allows you to add one more icon to the dock of your device. As you can see here, you can have five icons instead of four. Round Dock This tweak will add these rounded corners to the dock of your device. As you can see right here, both of the corners of the dock are rounded and it looks pretty cool. Safari Tab Count This is a simple tweak which will count how many tabs you have opened in Safari. You can see right here I have two, you can see if I open another one, here three, very useful tweak, very simple, it doesn't have any options to configure. Date in status bar. This tweak allows you to add the current date on the status bar of your device. You can see right here on the left side you will have the date, while on the right side you will have the clock. No page dots 7. This tweak will remove the page dots from the home screen of your device. As you can see right here, you will have a nice clean look without the page dots. Save Gram. This tweak allows you to save pictures from Instagram. It's pretty easy to use, all you have to do is just tap the dots right here and as you can see you will have a save option here to save this picture to your camera roll. Circle Icons. This tweak will make all the icons in the settings app circles. As you can see right here, all the icons are in circles. Very cool tweak, it doesn't have any options to configure. Time until alarm. This tweak will show you the time that you have left until your alarm goes off. You can see right here, you will have the hours and the minutes right beside the alarm that you have set. Better 5 column home screen. This tweak allows you to add another column of icons on your home screen and now you will have 5 instead of 4. Now this tweak doesn't have any options to configure but to download it you will need to add a repo which I will put in the description. Fake Carrier This tweak allows you to change the name of your carrier to any name you want. Here when you install it you will get this icon on your home screen, you open it up then go here to Fake Carrier enter any text right here and then just click set. Grabber time. This tweak will display the time and also the battery indicator here on the notification center grabber so when you're on full screen all you have to do is just show the grabber and you can see the time right here. Easy respring. This is a simple but useful tweak which allows you to easily respring your device directly from the app switcher all you have to do is just push up the home card and it will respring your device. No carrier. This is a simple tweak that allows you to remove the carrier text from the status bar of your iOS 9 device. This tweak doesn't have any options to configure, all you have to do is install it. System Aperio. This is a simple tweak, all it does is that it will blur out this part right here. When you open your control center, as you can see, it will blur out all this part right here and it looks pretty cool. CC Now Playing This tweak allows you to easily share what you're listening to to your social media. As you can see right here you have a Twitter and a Facebook icon. All you have to do is just tap that and you can quickly share this to your social media. Photo Size This tweak will show you the size of your photos when you select them. Here you can see when I select one picture it will show this size right here and when I select more it will show the size of all these pictures right here. Switcher Badges This tweak will show badges 
on the icons in the app switcher. As you can see right here, I have a badge on Cydia and it will show it on the app switcher. This is a simple tweak, it doesn't have any options to configure. Alarm. This tweak allows you to easily turn on or off all the alarms that you have set on your device. You can see this toggle right here. You can easily go ahead and turn on or off all the alarms that you have set on your device. Battery icon. This tweak will add this battery icon on the springboard of your device and when you tap it, it will take you directly to the battery settings on your settings app. And notice this battery icon is live, so it will change depending on the percentage of battery that you have on your device. Status hood 2. This tweak will replace your stock volume hood and will place the volume hood here on the status bar. As you can see, when I change the volume of my device, you can see here the hood will be placed on the status bar. Now if you go to the settings of this tweak, you have an enable button, then here you have style, you can choose between two different styles and also you can change its size right here. Icon Bounce. This tweak will add these nice animations to the icons of your dock on your iOS 9 device. Now if you go to the settings of this tweak, here you can enable it, you have different animations right here, you can disable or enable any of these animations and if you go back then you have here the bounce interval and also you have the animation duration and you can set them with these sliders right here. Glow badge. This tweak will replace the normal badges with a glow around the icons as you can see right here on the Cydia app. Now if you go to the settings of this tweak, you have an enable button, you can enable it in folders, then here you have the glow color, you can pick any color you like, then here you have show badge 4, you have no apps, only folders, app in list, you can pick which apps you want, or all the apps. Activator. Activator is a very famous tweak, which allows you to perform different actions using gestures. For example, here I can double tap the status bar, and as you can see, it will take a screenshot of my device. Now to set activator gestures, you need to go to settings, go to activator, go here, and then you can choose any gesture you want, go to the gesture, and here you can set an action for that gesture. Hide labels. This tweak allows you to hide the labels from the icons on your springboard. As you can see right here, none of the icons have labels. You can also hide the labels of the icons on the dock of your device and if you go to the settings of this tweak you can enable it right here hide dock icon labels also center dock icons vertically you can also enable hide other icon labels to hide completely all the labels of all the icons of your device switcher tweak this tweak allows you to customize the app switcher of your ios 9 device as you can see right here you can change the direction of the scroll and to do that you need to go to the settings of this tweak and here you have all kinds of customizations that you can do to your app switcher. You can enable this tweak right here, set here, the scroll direction, also you can disable the background blur, disable the SB page blur and also hide page labels and all kinds of customizations. Glow board. This tweak will add a glow around the icons which are running in the background or which have petting notifications like Facebook does right here. You can also here see on the dock, it will show a dot on the icons which are running in the background. Now if you go to the settings of this tweak, you can enable here display on dock, display on folder and also display in app switcher. Here you can set different animations for the glow and right here you can change the colors of the glow. So these are the top 80 city tweaks compatible with iOS 9. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. For more iOS 9 jailbreak videos, please make sure you subscribe. Also go ahead and follow me on Twitter. You can find a link to my Twitter account in the description of this video.